Welcome back, guys. I'm back with another read. Let's see what I want to start out with. Let's start out with the millennial. And let's get a message for the collective. Let's see what the collective needs to know. What does the collective need to know? Oh, okay. Well, viral wanted to jump out. So somebody could be going viral or they're already viral or like somebody's really popular. They just got their lucky break or they've been networking like crazy. Okay. We're going to pull it. We're going to leave that out. We're going to keep that in mind. Because it, it just flew out. The way it flew out is like y'all want to be here. All right, what does the collective need to know? What's going on with the collective? Mm, I'm hearing somebody say, stop flexing. Somebody said, stop flexing. Flatlining and flexing. Now, this is could be a repeat of the energy that I did yesterday. Because yesterday... I had that same energy, but it could be they want you to stop flexing because it's like you're popular now. You're moving around. You're doing things. You're getting your lucky break. You're becoming instantly famous. Your message is getting around quick. Like something that you have to offer is getting around pretty fast. And somebody is trying to want you to stop flexing. Yeah, but they doing it in a low-key way. Like, they doing it low-key. They're saying it low-key. They're not saying it, like, directly. They're indirectly throwing shade, okay? They are upset because they feel like they're missing out. Like, they're not a part of it. So, they're upset because they're not a part of it. What else? Bye, Felicia. Somebody just got canceled. Y'all gonna cancel their ass. They canceled. Bye, Felicia. Canceled. A whole group. It's, it could be a whole group. Bye. Unfriend, unfollowed, uncousined, unsistered, unbrothered, whatever. They gotta go. They gotta go. How you mad? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Swerve. <laughs> Swerve to change directions, to dodge somebody, to dismiss them, not interested, to send somebody for a loop. Okay, I don't know what they thought. Cause look, you don't went through a glow up, or you're getting ready to go through a glow up. You ain't got time for that type of energy no more. You don't got time for that. Somebody trying to put somebody on blast. Somebody trying to put somebody on blast. It could be somebody bae. But somebody's like trying to put somebody on blast. But I feel like if I feel like they're doing it low key though. Yep. Because this is what you getting. You getting a whole lot of approvals. You getting a yes. You getting a go. You doing it. Oh, you doing your thing. You doing your thing. It's something that you're doing. You've been getting a green light. And this person over here in their feelings. You know why they in their feelings? Because they've been capping about their goals. They've been capping about what they got going on. They've been capping about it. They ain't been telling the truth. So they could be telling you, yeah, I'm, I've been doing, oh, yeah, I got this to do. Yeah, I got that to do. But you really doing it, and they not, okay? They not. They're not doing it. You're putting in the work. They've been doing all this capping. Give me one more card. Give me one more card. Spirit. Okay, now that was just way too many. Every time I ask for one, Spirit be like, no. Take four. <laughs> Take all of them. <laughs> okay. Now, obviously, this person is shook. They're speechless. They're surprised. 
okay and they kind of want to like let you know how they feel but like i said they're doing it in a like a sneaky way they're not saying it with their chest they're not putting it 100 out there they're just throwing little subliminals here and there and that's the thing like no say it with your chest please please Say it with your chest. All right, let's get a little bit more information. Let's see if we can figure out this person's intentions. Because I don't like the energy. And this is the same energy that we had in yesterday's reading. So it's going on again today. So it's carried itself on into the next day. Okay, so let's see. What is this person's intentions? Why? Do they feel some type of way about the collective bossing up, having a glow up? Could be a Taurus. Yeah, look at this. I'm hearing a switch up. Three of Swords and the Chariot. Yep, changing up. Somebody feel like somebody changing up. The Will and the Six of Swords. Somebody is hurt because somebody switched up on them. And this is not the first time this happened either. Yep, somebody's surprised at some something that somebody said. Like, what? The Tower and the Page of Cups. It's like, what? Oh, that's how you feel? Don't worry about me. Ooh, Five of Wands. Wanted to jump, but I see somebody waiting. They're sitting here waiting for some type of explanation. I'm hearing them say that's why your baby daddy left or husband with this emperor or your masculine left the relationship because you want to go back and forth all the time. So this somebody who who real deal be was all up in your business, know some of your business. King of Swords. Yeah, okay. Waiting on an explanation. Somebody waiting on the explanation. They waiting around on the explanation. Waiting on you to say something. Okay, and then they want to come back and be friends. Three of Cups. So they want to see what you... They throwing out bait. They want to see what you got to say. Put the truth out on the table to see what you going to say. And then come around and try to be friends. Nah, 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 nah. Nah. Yep, I'm hearing change up. It could be involving family. Okay, with that four of wands. Why does King of Swords here? Ace of Pentacles. I'm hearing somebody start telling the truth. Okay. I'm hearing somebody started telling the truth and it made somebody have thought about it, thought about it, what was said, and then seeing going back to see what you're saying. So maybe you're speaking something, you're speaking your truth, how you feel about something. This person is like online, maybe you're talking about it online, but I'm hearing start a conversation, a serious conversation. But their intuition is telling them that you're going to block them or delete the comment before everybody uh, sees it. Oh, this person said they know how to make you slow down. They said they know how to make you slow down. They need to throw some little rocks at you.
Yeah, this person said they, they know how to make you slow down. They're trying to make you slow down. Now the Three of Cups. Oh, Two of Swords. They're not sure if y'all are cool anymore. They say, well, I don't know. I don't know. I guess we're not cool no more. I guess we're not friends no more. I guess that's it. Duh. Yeah. Okay. Now, with the Knight of Swords and the Six of Cups, I'm getting running back. Running back. Again and again. Okay. So, I'm getting like, this is a constant thing. This is a constant thing. And I'm hearing, leave me out of it. Leave me out of it. Mm-hmm. When somebody in their feelings because their relationship going wrong, I'm hearing, leave me out of it. Leave me out of it. Could be a Virgo. It's something here about don't think that they could leave. You didn't think that they could leave and you mad. That's childish. Okay, so yeah, I'm getting like a girl fight with the Empress and the Five of Wands. I'm getting like competition. So somebody, they decide to give something a try, being sneaky. And they're going to wait to the last minute to say something about it. So they are already upset about something that you might not even, you might not have even been paying attention, but they got upset about something. They got upset about something. This person is really surprised. They just surprised. They surprised. Like, I don't know. They're just real surprised. I'm getting a lot of jealous energy with that seven of wands and that five of swords. And I'm getting a lot of just back and forth. Back and forth energy. Like, oh, okay. The ten of swords. All that back and forth energy is ended. It finally ended. And I'm getting like not responding. Not responding. But they're spying on you. Just to see how you think, see how you're doing. But I'm getting not cool no more. Because this I'm hearing every time I come around, it's always something. To be said. About somebody, boyfriend, baby daddy, husband, father, somebody. Whoever this masculine energy is. Yeah, cut this person off and keep it moving. This person, none of this, none of this actually is a, is like a, it just sounds like a bunch of childish stuff, like competition. It is sound like a bunch of competition. All right, so that's the message that I got for y'all. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. If you're interested in booking a reading with me, guys, I'm doing $25 readings, so um, in order to contact me via email, the email address is in the comment section below. All right. It's pinned down there. So y'all let me know. Reach out to me. We'll get you set up. You'll get your reading within 24 hours. All right. So until next time. Ciao.